The streets of Burkina Faso's capital city, Ouagadougou, are busy again as people try to move on from the events of September 16th, which paralyzed all economic activity for a week. Saidou Zangre reopened his closed shop Saturday. The recovery can't be automatic. It is also our role to come back into the city center and show people that it's okay, that there is no problem anymore. The transitional government, led by interim president Michel Cafando, met Friday, two days after he announced he was back in charge. The decision was made to dissolve the presidential guard, the RSP, the elite unit which was behind the failed coup. The RSP has said it wanted inclusive elections and a reversal of a decree taken by transitional authorities a week earlier that barred some former members of ex-president Blaise Compare's government from running. Compare was ousted last year after he tried to change the constitution to run for another term. He had been in power for 27 years. Some critics say the RSP's demand was just an excuse to seize power. But a proof candidate, Adam Kanazoe, says if the issue has to be debated, he is open to dialogue. It is important to find a middle ground so that everybody can feel comfortable in Burkina Faso. The transitional government also agreed to investigate the failed coup, which killed 11 people while dismissing the Putsch's call for an amnesty. The election, initially set for October 11th, is likely to be delayed. No new date has been announced. Emily Yop for VOA News from Ouagadougou.